Hello everyone and welcome back to Nick's Naruto Reviews. Now, today, you guessed it, we're going to be talking about Naruto, possibly the best show ever. I love it so much. Nick, I need my yeah. belt. I'm late yeah. for work. Where is it? Okay, it's right on my bed. It's there? Okay, yeah. sweet. All yeah. Right. Nothing. Don't worry about it. I wasn't doing anything. You're not you doing don't anything? Don't even ask. Don't. Yeah, no, it's fine. Okay, excellent. Come yeah, with me. Okay. I actually need you. Alec, can you drive me to work today? I'm running late. No. Please. Please, can you seriously? I'm not, I'm not joking. No. Alex? Yeah. Please? Get the fuck out of my room. Ah, this reminds me. So, have you seen any good hentai recently? As a matter of fact, I have. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Do you mind sending it to me? Yeah, dude, I have a list. I'll send it to you. Ah, dope. This is my supervisor. His name is Justin. Fun fact about Justin, he has autism. What's he doing recording in here? Today is Take Your Brother to Work Day, which also happens to be Justin's least favorite day of the year. Mainly because his only memories of his older brother are of him getting chased around the house with a knife. Until one day he tripped, and his brother stuck it right to his throat and he said, Give me one reason, just I will cut you open, Justin. I will cut you open. Mom's gone. You're finished, buddy. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Yeah, he doesn't He doesn't like uh, Take Your Brother to Work Day very much. So I think he's trying to ruin it for me. What's wrong with his face? It's my brother, man. What's wrong with his face? He's dropped on his head, man. That makes sense. Well, that's not entirely true. See, our family's not sure exactly why Nick looks the way he does. Originally, our parents used to say that um, his nose was, like, pressed up against the womb throughout to the whole pregnancy, so when he came out, it was, like, flat, and then, oh, shit, that, wait, that's me. W whatever. The point is that Nick, despite being a very good, charming boy, has a hideously disfigured face. And for those of you who think I'm exaggerating, let me pull up a picture. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm gonna have to censor that. Nick, don't let him talk to you like that, okay? You gotta, you gotta fight back. Yeah. You know he is right, your face is fucking disgusting. Uh, he's recording. Can you just wait a sec? Yeah, so this is basically my job. I uh, put up fruits and vegetables and I take orders from my superiors. And honestly, you know, it's, it's not that bad. The bad part comes when customers ask me to check the back room for product. What's up? Yo, do you know where the uh, watermelons are? The watermelons. Uh, I have absolutely no clue what water you're speaking of. No, I, I, yeah, I see him. It's okay. I'm oh, oh, these! Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, the water Malones! Okay, I really wasn't sure what you were referring to. I w the customer's still here? Or have they yeah. left because of the sheer stupidity I see in front of me? No, I think... I, I wish I could go back in time and report your mother. The day you started working here, I've gotten stupider and stupider simply by being in your general aura. Okay. Why God thought to punish me with your 
sheer existence. I will never understand it. I've always been a religious man. Okay. You, you're just a disgusting human being. You and your pig fuck of a brother over there. Yeah, you know, yeah. just because you're white doesn't mean, you know, you're no alarm outside. Right? Okay, that's... I, yeah. I see them. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll go tell the customer. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking faggot. This is accused child molester, Samuel Hyde. Shortly after the recording of this clip, six children went missing in our district. In this video, he is seen showing Matt an open package of ice cream sandwiches. As you probably wouldn't be able to tell, Matt is on a diet and doesn't react very well to the smell of these delicious treats. If you have any insight that could lead to the arrest of this man, please contact local authorities. Come here, fucking wave these things under my nose like that. Sam, that we were cool, man. Yeah, what is it? Yeah, it's uh, cuties, you know. It's uh, ice cream sandwich stuff. Someone's stealing it? Yeah, someone's stealing it. Little did I know that those weren't the only cuties that would be stolen that night. Ah, lunchtime. When I was working as a painter, this was my favorite part of the day. But here, not so much. You see, lunchtime happens in the dark-lit dungeon of the store, where everyone's just trying to avoid eye contact and conversation, basically. Don't fucking look at me. Oh. Okay. You're a cunt. Yeah, but this time since I had Nick with me, I decided to go and eat lunch outside. Uh, so what do you think? About what? About my job. What do you think? Uh, <clears throat> it's, it's great. Yeah? Yeah. I don't agree. I think it's really bad. <laughs> I, uh, I don't like it very much, but uh, that's just me. Yeah. Is that Phil? Do you see that? What? Mm -hmm. what? Oh, yeah, there is. What is that? Yo, what? What? That is Phil. That is Phil. Oh my god. Where did he go? That was definitely Phil. Was it? Don't know what he's doing, don't really care. Break's almost over. You ready for round two? Round two? What? I thought it was over. No. It was true. I had only told Nick that he'd have to be there for the first half of my work. But my mission had yet to be accomplished. You see, while I got plenty of footage of Matt verbally abusing me, there was one thing that I needed to get off my chest. Hey, Matt. Yeah? You're, you're, you're fat. No words can describe the face that I saw. The perfect embodiment of a big mistake lay upon the torso of this girthy man. I did not know how I would have to repay this misdoing, but I knew that it would have to be repaid. Like, can you be any, like, less useful? I swear to God, like, it's when we're in work, you can't fucking do shit. And who's one's gonna fucking pick up the pace? Me, you goddamn motherfucking dumb cunt. Like, yeah. actually. Anything else? Yeah, you're a Matthew, how do I get into the trunk? No, 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 you know what, buddy? You did so good today, you can sit in the back seat. I knew I could earn it one day. Oh, why are there so many fucking food wrappers here? Yeah, Ooh. that's the garbage seat. That's what you're fucking sitting in. All right, guys, everyone got their seatbelts on? We're all, we're all being safe? Good. There's nothing I hate more than people who are unsafe, you little piece of shit. Well, that's yeah. what happened. Why do you think he was born? <laughs> oh. Justin's come to play. I like this. Autism is a double-edged sword. <laughs> well, you have autism? So is my mom. I thought you had Asperger's. No, that's just what I do at night. Mmm, fair enough. I'll look. Oh, shit. What? Okay, can tell she's 50 and cute? Stop, you're a pedophile. No, this one could, no, this one's definitely what? a What just happened? And another thing, Justin, you have a small penis. It's average to some Asian women. How do you know that? Anyway, shut the fuck up. As if you think you have the right to fucking talk in this car. You have no fucking privileges. Just because you're white doesn't mean shit. He's pretty Jewy though. You're the fucking Jew nose. I knew fucking it. slit that junk Juno Juno's right off. I knew it would go there. You get a fucking Juno award. 
Oh, jeez. Oh, Chris, we're almost to your place. That's good. Once we get there, I can kill your whole family. Mm, <laughs> why? Jesus. I mean, I want to... Yeah, it's just, you know what, one of those things on the, on the bucket list, if you know what I mean. To kill someone's whole family? Uh, yeah, no, actually just yours. Hey, Nick. If I ever told you you look like you were born out of an ear hole. Yo, yo, I got some spare shackles for you. Yeah? Not you. Oh. The Jew. Whoa! Get him! Keep keep this up, and you're gonna get the passenger seat soon. Oh shit! I kind of like the trunk, though. You know why you belong in the trunk? Cause you got a great ass. In this world of of tragedy and disaster, it's it's nice, you know, just to give someone a compliment for no reason. Anyways, here you are. Oh, um, by the way, I'm gonna kill your whole family. What? Anyways, here you are. There you go. Are uh, you in tomorrow? Yeah. Alright, nice. I'll see you then. Yeah. Thanks for the ride. No worries. Wait, I have to get out. Nah, you're good, champ. You're good. You're coming home with me tonight, son. Oh, no. Ladies, how much for a little suck suck, eh? <laughs>